Hi everyone, I'm Lynette with Charmed Grammy Crochet and today is Monday the 19th and I got happy mail. Oh, I'm so excited. I did a yarn swap with my friend Trisha Swift, Mama Swift, um, and she should be getting her yarn today as well. I did open the box because I started this, then I got a text and it cut it off. So we're going to have to start over, but first thing I got was a bag from Trader Joe's in Santa Monica, California, because she's in California. Um, so she sent this clear across the country to me. I really appreciate that. And this is going to be the new bag for my new project that I'm starting today. I know, another with, but I have to make the... Um, the wedding shawl, the shawl for the wedding, and I'm going to start that today. Uh, so that's perfect. And I never, I didn't know this, but Miss Mama Swift apparently makes soap. It says, uh, this is for me, and it says, Handmade with Love from Mama Swift. Um, and you can email her if you would like some soap, Mama Swift 3 at gmail.com. Um, an order for some soap from Trisha. They're numbered. Uh, let's see. I kind of like don't want to unwrap them. This first one is in a square. Let's see. And it is activated charcoal facial bar. I don't know if I should unwrap these, Trish. But I want to show them so that people might buy them. And a little handmade sticker on there. Look at that. I bet it smells wonderful. I don't have a sense of smell, so I can't tell you. But I will be using this as of today. Oh, I'm so excited about that. Let's see. Um, I kind of didn't want to unwrap them because I was afraid I wouldn't. But they're, I mean, it's a solid bar. Trish, how do you do this? Trish does not do videos. So we may never know. The second one is um, Spiced Kitchen Bar. So do you wash dishes with this, I'm going to assume? Not just your hands. Look at that. I wish I could smell it. It says it's spiced, so I bet it smells yummy. I don't, my husband's napping after work. He gets up very early and he takes a nap. I can't even ask him to come and smell them. This is going in the kitchen right after this video. Oh, Trish, this is so exciting. I've never had handmade soaps before. Um, and this vinyl one is Luxury Sea Salt Bar. Ooh. Ooh. Come on now, it's a big one. They all have the handmade sticker. Oh, oh, I should put it up here where you can see too. Let's see what, oh, dropped, dropped my twine on the floor. Oh, it's rough to the touch. Oh, this is fabulous, like for exfoliating. I love that because I get so dry I need to exfoliate quite frequently. Oh, it feels so nice just like, rubbing my hand on it. Oh, Trish. Oh, that, God, I wish I could smell it. Thank you. So, oh my gosh, I'm just overwhelmed. Wow. And she got some for my husband, too. This is for my husband. Um, pumpkin spice is the square. And oak tree is the round. I'm going to let him unwrap them and smell them for himself, and then he can smell mine, too. Ah, <laughs> oh, Trish, that's so cool. And then there's so many things in here. Holy cow. Um, well, let's see. There's, I can't believe you fit all this in here. There are two of the Premier by Deborah Norville. Uh, I believe they're the same color. They are, uh, where's the color? Come on. I know it's not hard to find. Uh, Anti-pilling, 203 yards. Premier yarns. I love Premier yarns. Orange flame. 
love orange flame. I have a whip bag already that has a, um, I want to do a granny square blanket neon. Um, I have some, you know, with neon yarn and then add uh, black borders, you know, and make granny squares, and put it, you know, so it's the neon. I love the look of that. And then look, there's two more in the yellow. Uh, and the yellow color is called fluorescent yellow. Awesome. That's going right in that whip bag. I just have to find it. Because it's blankets and it's coming up later. Then there's this very cool. What is this? Um, I can't even begin. It's a cotton. And you guys can see if you can read that label. It's a cotton yarn. It is a... 100 gram ball, 380 meters, 45% bone oil, bone oily, I don't even know. And then it says 45% cotton, 45% cotton. I'm, I'm, and then it says it's got some virgin woolen. Oh, okay, I get it. So it's 45, I'm not, the first language is not English. Get it together here, okay? It's 45% cotton, 42% virgin wool, and 13% polyamide. Look at that. That is awesome. Very fine weight, like a fingering weight. Love it. Blues and greens and yellows. It's got a whole gambit of colors in there. That one's very cool. Then she's got these. Oh, goodness. Look at these. These are made by Claudia. Handmade painted yarns. Can you see that? Handmade painted yarns. 175 yards, approximately 50 grams. Um, use a 1 to 3 U.S. hook. 175 yards, hand wash. These are gorgeous. I don't know if there's, let's see, Claudia and Company in Harrisburg, Virginia. Uh, ClaudiaCompany.com, ClaudiaCO.com. These are hand fingering weight, 100% merino wool. Look at those. They are beautiful and so soft. Hand painted. Wow, I'm impressed. I'm over the moon. Oh, <laughs> look at this. This is Madeline. It's 57% uh, acrylic, 30% poly made, 13% wool. It's not at all scratchy. It's got gold glitters in there and silver glitters in there. This one is fabulous. Oh my gosh. You packed so much in here. Look at this cotton chenille. Um, look at this beautiful. I love the pale yellow color. Uh, Crystal Place yarns, 100% cotton, approximately 98 yards. Um, spun in Belgium. Crystal Place yarns from Richmond, California. Wow. That is, wow. Trish, I'm sorry I got interrupted with a phone, um, a text message. So we were at, I believe, this yarn that matches the yellow. I love the colors together. Aren't they gorgeous? Oh, goodness. Beautiful. They're brighter on the screen. They're very pale and subtle and oh gosh I love them then we got three I think these are all the same cartwheel yes cartwheel yarns they're three different ones um cart oh wait oh wait this one's cartwheel these are cache I'm sorry these are different okay we'll go with this one this one is cartwheel. It's 100% wool, um, 77 yards. It's a four weight. 
It's not scratchy at all. I love it. Um, I'm trying to find a color. Color just gives you, oh, Coral Reef. Oh, look at all the colors in there. Yellows and blues and pinks. It's got just gray. It's just got everything. Oh, that is gorgeous. Then two of this one, two different colors. Um, this one is called Cache. Oh, I think I have it upside down. It's like the same yarn, different type, because this one has sparkles in it. Yay, I love the sparkle. And these are called, um, oh goodness, now I lost it. Oh, uh, wait, no, 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 no. I think this one is confetti. There's a sticker over it, so it's hard to tell. And this one is rendezvous. Again, beautiful colors in those. Can you see them both? Gorgeous. Oh my goodness, Trisha. I'm overflowing here. This is the one. I was expecting this one. I'm going to rip it open out of the bag. This is the cupcake. She made it all smelly with a a smelly good dryer sheet. Uh, this is Sandcastle. This is the cupcake to finish my circle shawl um, that I ran out of yarn for and went to three stores and could not find. Trisha had some. Yay! Thank you, Trisha. And then there's this box of it's called DIY a gradient yarn. Look at this. All in the box. All the pretty colors. All designed in a row for you to make something spectacular. Hats. They have different things on the back. Totally very cool. Look at the scarves and the hat and mittens. I tried mittens one time. I'll never do that again. Chloe got mittens and they were terrible for me to make. But you could red, orange, all the way down to yellow, like coral and pink and yellow. Beautiful. Thank you so much, Trisha. These are fabulous. I'm so excited. Thank you, thank you, thank you. And thank you all for watching and sharing in my Happy Mail yarn swap package. Uh, I hope you enjoyed it. I sure did. I can't wait to try my new soaps. Handmade soaps. Awesome beautiful yarns of every color and imaginable everything sparkle and bright and hand dyed oh my gosh I just can't even I can't I can't even thank you so much Trisha have a great day everyone thanks for liking subscribing sharing and enjoying my yarn journey with me bye bye